In 2021, I started using historical photos of African American women to make portraits of them. Many of these women were not well known to me, and these portraits were my way of honoring their accomplishments and making them known to others. I have included many of these portraits in a book I am in the process of publishing and in this slideshow. Portraits in the past were used to commemorate people, which is what I want to do with each of these women I've painted. Since most of these portraits are based on old black and white photos, I had freedom to use the colors that I wanted. I was inspired by Matisse and his use of colorful textiles for the color choices for many of my portraits. Of the women I chose, many have made their accomplishments in advancements in civil rights. Dr. Dorothy Height is one example. Others, like Polly Jackson, were known for helping with the Underground Railroad. It was rumored that she fought off slave catchers with boiling water and a bowie knife. I painted portraits of journalists like Ida B. Wells and Mary Parrish, who wrote about lynchings and also the Tulsa Massacre of 1921 to bear witness to events so that they would not be forgotten. I chose a number of women in the arts, women like Augusta Savage and Edmonia Lewis, who fought racism in their attempts to get educated, sometimes being turned down for scholarships when administrators found out they were black. Some, like Billie Holiday, used their fame to draw attention to racist Jim Crow laws in the South. Horrific wrongs led others on the path to fight for civil rights. Racy Taylor is an example of someone who led the fight for equal justice for all in the eyes of the law. It wasn't until 2011, when she was in her 90s, that she finally got an apology from the Alabama government for not incarcerating her rapists. So far, I have painted 40 portraits in this series to bring attention to the achievements of these black women who often have been ignored by the history books. I am grateful for getting to know each one of these women and their accomplishments. You can find additional women and more information about these women on caroljacobson.com, my website.